going on everybody? I'm home. You hear me talk about Xbox Syndicate at the end of every single show. Exodus Bros started off a new group called Canadian Trivia and Facts. Go check it out at xboxsyndicate.com. Donkey Kong. Donkey Kong. Not Donkey Kong. Canadian Trivia and Facts. Brought to you by XX Bro. Exodus Bro. By Exodus Bro. So rumor has it there's Xbox fans out there. It's just a rumor. And what is the Xbox missing? Well. Maybe the hype of the whole Nintendo Wii is what the Xbox is missing. And maybe not the hype as much as the hardware. The whole premise around it is the, uh, you know, the infrared controllers and being able to move everything around like you want without, well, wires. Microsoft use 3D tech in the next Xbox update. Nintendo Wii is the hottest thing since sliced bread. Uh, sliced bread's pretty cool. All our companies are simply playing catch up. Not like catch up on sliced bread. That's kind of a funny combo to use. VentureBeat.com is reporting that Microsoft is trying to purchase an Israel company called 3DV Systems for $35 million. That is a heck of a lot of money. So what does this have to do with making up ground in Nintendo's motion control? Well, it just happens to be that 3DV Systems developed something called the Z-Cam. It's aided a 3D camera that picks up all the different motions. So now instead of uh, having a physical controller, you could just hold your hands up and control or steer, it would pick that up. I love you Microsoft, you got a lot of money and you can buy this stuff. You make us very, very, very happy. Yes you do. Okay, I don't normally talk about old things or old tech or old games, but I have to talk about this. Frontlines Fuel the War. $14.99 I bought this used at Blockbuster. Now, this game is amazing. I couldn't stop playing it. I played it right through till the end. I only played it, played it on casual, but I just really wanted to get the storyline and see what the game was like. It's phenomenal. You have little droids that you can control, whether it be a helicopter one, a hover one, a tank with different guns. Now it's based in the future, in the 2020s. Now, it's first person shooter. It's all about oil fight. The oil's running out. We're over on the other side of the world fighting. We're trying to save North America. But it's just, it's done so well, it uses the Unreal Engine to, to the fullest. The environments are beautiful and outlined, the screenplay and everything is flawless. Check this out, it does uh, online play. I haven't tried it yet online, but if it plays anything like the single player, then uh, pick it up. That's uh, Frontline's Fuel War, you can pick it up used, I'm sure, for 20 bucks, or check it out at any uh, used store. Now I'll be, 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 be damned. Can you imagine? Xbox 360 controller playing on your PlayStation 3? You're a little envious, I think, are you, Sony people? Well, the company has brought out a, like a USB-style adapter that enables you to play your Xbox 360 controller on your PlayStation 3. Yes, I said it, on your PlayStation 3. For all you envious Sony PlayStation people out there, this adapter can uh, cost you 40 bucks and you can use a controller, or, or, you can sell your system on uh, any used site like Gigi and uh, buy yourself an Xbox 360. Then come over and sign up at xboxsyndicate.com and, you know, brag about your new great controller. You can see I'm kind of working in the dark here a little more. I'm a lot brighter normally. To be honest, I really didn't feel like hooking up my halogen lights. They're bright as hell. They make my room warm. And I didn't want to hook them up. So I'm going to use just my civil light shining on my face and... Yet another neat laptop comes out, and the company Arcos. Now you've probably seen them in stores selling the portable devices, you know, the original video players and so on. Now they've come out with a laptop. They wanted to jump onto the laptop market with some respectable stats. So you're not going to get your, your Vista system, but it does come with Microsoft Windows Home Edition, uh, an Intel Atom N270 1.6 processor, a 160 gig hard drive. Which is pretty good on a portable unit. A lot of them are now just coming with small flash drives and, and upgrades with uh, uh, SD cards or compact flash and so on. One gigabyte, I mean, one gigabyte of DDR2 RAM, uh, multi card reader slot, Wi Fi, and 3G USB ready. So if you want to stick in your anywhere to go Rogers uh, USB um, little dongle, then it's going to work. It should work anyways, but whatever, that's what it says on the site. Uh, three USB ports, that's fine. And this is a 10.2 inch uh, WXGA screen at 1024 by 600 res. 
So that's, that's awesome. I'm loving that the companies are coming out with these smaller laptops now. And the market must be doing alright or, or companies like the Acos wouldn't jump onto it. They'd just stick into their MP3 and media market. Yes, it's cool. Yes, it is. It's very neat. Samsung's still at hard work. They're uh, bringing out new cell phones. It's a, just a constant battle for them. And there's a couple sneak peeks now of three new phones brought out by them. That's the Ultra Touch, the Omnia HD, I like the sound of that, and the Beat DJ. Wooka 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 Beat DJ. I'm not sure if I'm going to buy a cell phone called the Beat DJ, but I have some pictures out here. Four phones offer touch displays, touch displays with media, multimedia focus, 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 multimedia focus. <laughs> this show has been brought to you by xboxsyndicate.com xboxsyndicate.com You've been watching Xbox Syndicate. Go over today at www.xboxsyndicate.com and sign up today for a free membership. What the hell is that? So if you haven't watched the show yet, you don't know what you're missing. Actually, you're not missing much, but you should watch it anyway. Make sure you tell everybody about it. Because I work hard at this every single week, I have fun with it, and uh, I love posting it, so keep watching. If anybody has any requests, uh, email them in at hilliercraig at gmail.com. Post them on the uh, Syndicate blog site there. <laughs> the Syndicate blog site. On xboxsyndicate.com, you can go into the Tech Tac TV group. And you can post any requests in there. Hi, I'm Craig Hillier. You've been watching Tech Tac. Doobie dee, doobie da. See you next week. Yeah, I see you. You're watching Tech Tech. Keep watching.